the my rivets working to your distraction. You'll be sharing with all your dinful sobs when we'll go riding a Koopa Curly, you with your orange garland and me with my tiny cordial down the grease ways of rollicking into the waters of wetted life. B. Dork. And sure, where can you have such good old times anywhere? And distraction. You'll be sharing with all your dinful sobs when we'll go riding a Koopa Curly, you with your orange garland and me with my tiny cordial down the grease ways of rollicking into the waters of wetted life. B. Dork. And sure, where can you have such good old chimes anywhere and leave you as on the mash and how did I would be engaging you with my plubbery soft accent and descanting up over the scene beyond me of your loose vines and their hair fall with them to loving loose braceleting the slims of your ankles and your mouth's flower rose and sinking off to the soapstone of silvery speech. See, noblet, issue why wouldn't we be happy of earning on the mill's money he'd soon be leaving you as soon as I my own owned Brookline Georgian mansion's lawn to recruit upon my Dr. Cheek's special orders and my copper's handful of soybeans and Irish in my east hand and the James's gate in my west after all the arrears and erroribus of comparative and battle history and your good self churning over the new leaves butter, more power to you, the choicest of the cheapest from Atlanta to Oconee while I'd be drowsing in the garden. D. Dalway. I cooked my thoroughgoing coffee the first down Spanish place. Nayo I make, two of my takes, sly goat sleek, but always grace. Holy eel and sainted salmon, chucking chub and ducking days, rod irons not your equal, says she, left in half the lane. ADCD. A bell, a bell on Sheldal's steeple, on we'll go mass on Christmas people. Shan praise Ganes, our face more neeper, our praying shan deepen, pay name we feepen, my name on equal. Five. What slags of a lock lad would retten smutty flesks, empty out old man's, milk vicious gate, scare off Jack and Jill's frutty landing, smooth thick waste papish pastures, insides man outside of angel, sprink dirt and water around village, newses to bagan and Swedes, plain general kept, loudin on the crop field, for treats given to malafides, out shriek, yelp, yelp, not his hair after bubble oars, might under whole three bonnets, puts polished crotty butts, night cover all fire glims, serves time till bass, grindstone his knives, fullest boarded, lewd man of the method of godliness, perchance he knows and dance, sits in the school wagon, XWCA, on ZWCU doorsteps limited, or bay windows broth swabber preferred. Walter closeters and sons, with the H.E. chimneys company, to not scrape, will, on advices, be bacon or stable hand, must be grateful standingly, Ira's langard, job lander or North Quain bigger preferred, all duties, kind rights, family feud, outings five, may get earned, no get come profusional drink laws to please abstain, he is far below sounding in mood mind fortune, but ale Connor man, nay, that must he isn't. Answer, poor old Joe. Six, what means the saloon slogan, summon in the house sweet diner? Answer, talk. Gadori did at the stage of plot now and I have to beeswax to bring in all the clove of the forks to it, how I saw, I knew his stain on the flower if me asked and can could speak, and he called me by me midden name. I am your honey honey sucker, foot with the bay, and who brought the dandelion, and who seen the black currant jam for tomorrow's big picnic? I hope it'll praise the climate of all Ireland. I heard the grattles and ice skinning the crock, and all your sandwiches tippin' per leg for Drake. Talk. And who ate the last of the goose bellies that was moulding from measles years? And who left that there? And who put that here? And who left the Kilkenny stale the chump? And who was it you was it propped the pot in the yard? And what in the name of the nook are you rubbing the side of the floor of the lobby with? Shite. Will you have a plateful? Tap. Seven. Who are those component partners of our society? The door boy, the cleaner, the soldier, the crook, the squeezer, the lounger, the curman, the tourabout, the mushroom sniffer, the bleaker blue tramp, the fun powder plotter, the Christie man's boxer, from their Paris L.A. and Donnybrook Crater, and Roebuck's Campos, and the Idler around town, and Cromglen's grassy, but Kimmage's champ, and Ashtown Fields, and Cabra Fields, and Finglass Fields, and Santry Fields, and the fields of Rahini, and their fails and Baldoyle to them, who are late comers all the years round by anticipation, are the porters of the passions in virtue of retro rationation, and contributing their contingent controversies of differentiation, unify their boxes in a vote of vaccination, who crunch the crusts of comfort due to depredation, drain the meat of misery to incur intoxication, condone every evil by practical justification, and con- damn any good to its own gratification, who are ruled, roped, duped, and driven by those new men diamonds, the fee keepers of their laws, nightly consternation, fortnightly fornication, monthly misericordation, and omni-annual recreation, doils when they deliberate with Sullivan's when they are swords, Matey, Teddy, Simon, Jorn, Peter, Andy, Barty, Philly, James, Moore, and Tom, Matt, and Jake's McCarthy. Answer, the Morpheus. Eight. And how are your Maggies? Answer, they war loving, they love laughing, they laugh weeping, they weep smelling, they smell smiling, they smile hating, they hate thinking, they think feeling, they feel tempting, they tempt daring, they dare waiting, they wake taking, they take thanking, they thank seeking, as born for lawn in law of love, to live and wife by wile and rile, by rule of roost, weave, rose, and hose, hold home, yet come up below here, coach and four, sweet peck my heart, picks one man more. Nine. Now to be on a new and basking again in the panorama of all floors of speech, if a human being duly fatigued by his deity in the suit, having plenty of time on his gouty hands and vacant of space at his sleepy feet, and as hapless behind the dreams of accuracy as any Camelot prince of Denmark, were at this actual future preterating constant in the states of suspensive animation accorded through the eye of a noodle with an ear-sighted view of old hope and haven, with all the ingredient and egregious whites and ways to which, in the curse of his persistence, the course of his story will have been having recourses, the reverberation of not cracking oars, the reconjugation of no binding eyes, the redissolutingness of mind molded ease, and the thereby hang of the whole of it, could such a nun, whilst even led come silences to come lie with her, and till in history was not, should catch the Gallic rye and spot Lucan's dawn, by hold that one's what is main and white is twain, how one once meat melts in t'other one's poining, the sap rising, the falls falling, the nim now nihilant round the girly head so become, the restless in the womb, all the rivals to all see, shake again, all oh, disaster, shake a lose, ah, how starring, but hangs got a bit of horse's nose, and Jeff's got the signs of ham round his mouth, and the bow that spun beautiful pales as it falls, what rose roared, and orageous rose yellow and green, blew out the end of its violet sky, then what would that fargazer seem to seem self to seem seeming of, dim it all, answer, a collider's gate. Ten. What bitters love but yearning? What sour love much but a breath burning till she that draws doth smoke return? Answer, I know the pet, of course, dear, but listen, precious. Thanks, pet, those are lovely, pet, delicious. But mind the wind, sweet. 
What exquisite hands you have, you angel. If you didn't gnaw your nails, isn't it a wonder you're not ashamed of me, you piggy? Perfect little piggy. I'll nod you in a minute. I bet you use her best Parisian sneer off her vanity table to make them look so rose stop, low stop, no stop. I know her. Slight me, would you? For every got I care. Pre cleaning the day, the first during her shower and wipe off with tissue, then after clean up and of course before retiring. Give me shawl. When I think of that espouse of a clan carby, the food brawler, and the associationist party with his black leaded chest. Hello, friend or gas, that you innkeeper, and all his fourteen other fullback maulers or hurling stars or whatever the day goes they are, baiting at my lord honour is just because they won the egg and spoon there so overly provincial at Bordeaux. My Irish accent, he see, makes his admiration. He is seeking an opening, and means to be first with me as his belle alliance. And you must no play the loso. So, 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 such as Spanish. Stupid at close to feet. Delighted to simple. Like Jolio and Rome Union. I haven't felt so Turkish for ages and ages. Minds me of squishes, the chocolate with the soul. Extraordinary. Why, what are they, all the mucky lot of them on it? Shh, I wouldn't pay three hairpins for them. Pet. That's right, hold it steady. Leg me pull. Who? Come big to Iran. Who? What are you nudging for? No, I just thought you were. Listen, love you. Of course, it was too kind of you, miser, to remember my size and shocking, my often expressed wish when you were wondering about my true sores, and before I forget it, don't forget, in your extensions to my personality, when nothing my remembrance type, she weak will be trotting back with red heels at the end of the moon, but look what the fool bought cabbage head, and as I shall answer to gracious heaven, I always in always remind of snappy you Gerter, me being always the one for charms, with my very best in proud and loving, even if he was to be a million miles my youth to live on, the rubber end of Mr. Poking Thorn, the quonian freshmonger who Mother Brown solicited me for unlawful converse with, with her mug of October, a pots on it, creaking around on his old shanks axle, like a crusty old corn quick, airman water wag terrier blazer, I'm fine, thanks ever, ha, oh my you put it. Shall I cook him in Momo? Mum mum. Funny spot to have a kingy. I'm terribly sorry, I swear to you I am. May you never see me in my birthday pet seem so too too, and that her blanches angels may rot lepros off her, whatever winking maggies I'll bet by your cut, you go flirting after with all the glass on her, and the jumps in her somewhere. Ha ha, I suspected she was. Sink her. May they fire her for a barren you. So she says, Tay for thee. Well, I say, angst so much, and desired she might not take it amiss if I esteem her but an odd. If I did a top turf, I'm not a mishy missy. Of course I know, pet, you're so learningful and considerate in yourself. So friend of vegetables, you long cold cat you. Please be acquiesced to meek my acquaintance. Coddling, snakelet, icicleist, my diaper is more life to. Who drowned you in Greer's man, or are you pillared with ink? Did a weep get past the gates of your pride? My tread on the clover, sweetness? Yes, the buttercups told me, hug me, damn it all, and I'll kiss you back to life, my peaches. I mean to make you suffer, meddler, and I don't care this pig for content to courting. That I chid you, sweet sir, you know I'm tender by my eye. Can't you read by dazzling ones through me through? Bite my laugh ears, drink my tears, pour into me volumes, spell me stark and spill me swooning. I just don't care what my quarters think. Trans name me loveliness now and hear me for all time. I'd risk a policeman passing by, McGrath, or even that beggar of a boots at the post. The flame? Oh, pardon. That was what? Ah, uh, did you speak, stuff? stuff? More poetries from Shakespeare's with Greek choral music, or ejaculation from the Garden of the Soul? Or by the live in the immoralities? Oh, you mean the strangle for love, and the suable of the prettiest? Yet we open half causeries in the home, and once upon a week I improve on myself. I'm so keen on that new free woman with novel inside. I'm always as tickled as can be over man in a surface by the lady who pays the rate. But I'm as pie as is possible. Let's root out Brin Stoker and give him the thrall of our lives. It's Dracula's night out. For Crete's sake, don't make a flush. Draw the shades, cough you, and I'll beat any son to love. Holy bug, how my highness would jump to make you flame your harbour bannon in two when I'd run my burning torch like through to adore me there and then cease to be. Whatever for, Blossom. You'd hear me, Jake, if you had one. If I am laughing with you, no lovingest, I'm not so dying to take my rise out of you, adored. Not in the very least. True as God made my mama hip length modesty coat mother. It's only because the reason is I'm only any girl, you lovely fellow of my dreams, and because old Sambubi is not around about my twisting of the tulip is, like that puff tape bucking daughter and a soiling us behind. What a nerve. He thinks that's what the best is for. How vain that hope in Cleric's heart, who still pursues the ultra heart, cocksure that rusty gown of his will make fair Sue forget his fizz. Tame ships. Blessed Marguerite bosses, I hope they threw away the mole, or else we'll have ball shotters and sour no with their medical associations all over the place. But hold hard till I got my latchkey vote, and I'll teach him when to wear what women call ours, on account of the gloss of the Glacian has a boob robbies is a bobel. And because you pluckless Lankaloo, I hate the very thought of the thought of you, and because, dearling, of course, the doors, I was always meant for an engineer from the French college to be husband, nom de chien, when we do when contract with Incho Tencho Solver, when you are married to reading and writing, which please business now won't be long, for he's so loopy on me, and I'm so leafy like since the day he carried me from the boat, my saviour of the heroes, to the beach, and I left on his shoulder one fair hair to guide hand and nine to its softness. Ever so sorry, I beg your pardon. I was listening to every treasured word I said fell from my dear mother's tongue. Otherwise, how could I see what you were thinking about, Grand? Only, I wondered if I threw out my shaving water. Anyway, here's my arm, pull of neck, gracefully yours. Move your mouth towards mine, more precious, more and more. To please me, treasure. Don't be a... I'm not going to... Shh, nothing. A quick crate somewhere. Bye-bye, I'm fly. Here to be under the line. You know, being clear all against gravestone. They hiss his hands. Darn, darn, man. So chip, 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 off for the love of my door. The little past door I go you before, so. And you're at my entrance, eh? Shy is in, Dobby. Must forget there's an audience. I have been lost, angel. Cuddly, deadly. It's our toot toot. Hear you. Sensation. Let them their whole four courtship. Let them. Big ball on his boozers. Eleven makes twelve territorials. The old socks hole that wants wide streets to commission their nice and thin at the Mitchells versus Nichols. Tabe selve aqua valle. And my waiting twenty class birds, sitting on their styles. Let me finger their eurythmic. And you'll see if I'm set on. They're all of them out to feed. Wait. In the name of. And all the holly. And some the miscellaneous and tides. Hoost. Ahem. There's Ada, Beth, Celia, Delia, Ina, Freta, Gilda, Hilda, Eta, Jess, Kathy, Lou. They make me cough as sure as I read them. Mina, Nipper, Opsy, Paul, Queenie, Ruth, Saucy, Frix, Una, Vela, Wanda, Zania, Eva, Zulma, Phoebe, Thelma, and me.
A ring, a ring, a rosary. Then everyone will hear it. Whose wishes is the father of my thought? But I'll plant them a proposal for their no man's ladder. When they're out with the Danas doing chaperone mouth, bright pigeons all over the world will fly with my mistletoe message round their love ribbons next and a crumb of my cake for each chance to We keep all 